I was meeting her family for the first time. Everyone was kind of uneasy and didn't know what to say. You could tell by the vigorous chewing. I know this. Wanda, why don't you tell us a story? Of course, I didn't have a story. So I went looking for one. Excuse me, what are you reading? Sorry, did you want to read this? I don't know, are there any good stories in it? <laughs> Say demand. Say what? Demand. Why do you call it that? Do you even read the news? Everyone the journalists interview try to make their story sound like the best one, or the worst one, as the case may be. And the journalists try to make themselves look like the best journalists. Said demand, it's all for show, for attention. Oh, so you mean like bullshit? There are children present. So, why do you read it? I'm sorry? If it's demand, why do you read it? Look. There are free newspapers all up and down the street. Or you can take mine. Just all I ask is that you leave me in peace. How can I help you? I'm looking for a story. What kind of story? A good one, not bullshit. Okay. Well, nonfiction is along the far wall to your left, and fiction stories are on the B level, and if you're looking for history or reference books, that would be on the second floor. Where are the good stories? All around. Are you looking for any particular kind of story? A good one. Yeah, you said that. Well, uh, tell you what, I'll give you a map of the library. That should help you figure out what you want. Can I help you with anything else? Um, no. No, I think I'll try and find a story on my own. Thanks. We have lots of stories here. We are a library.
you find the story you were looking for? No, not really. These are all stories, by some definition at least. You've got tons of things here. Creation stories, Shakespeare, Moby Dick, even X-Men? None of these are what you were looking for? No, none of them are quite right. Besides, I couldn't possibly carry this whole stack home. I will keep the map, though. It's very helpful. Well, wait, excuse me. <sighs> None of the stories I'd found so far were the right one to bring back to M.A. She'd want something fun and exciting, something personal. I went downtown for a drink, thinking maybe somebody at the bar would have a good story. They're still not right somehow, and I don't know where to look next. If I can't find a story by morning... Everyone I talked to all had stories. Who am I if I don't have one? something? I'm looking for a story. A story? Why is that? And these parents asked me for one. I'm scared what they'll think of me if I don't have one. I'm scared what I'll think of me. Don't you have some stories there? Well, yes, but I don't think any of them are the right one. Besides, they're not mine. They're just random things. I got them from other places. Where? Well, I went to get a coffee, and there was someone in there reading a newspaper, but they said it was bullshit. Mm -hmm. So I went to a library, because, you know, it's a library, mm -hmm. and I pulled out all these books about heroes and love and war and everything, but none of them were about me. So I went to a bar, 
sort of place to see if anybody there would tell me a story, and they told stories, but now all I know is not to date men named Adonis, which is irrelevant to me. So now what do you have? A bunch of newspapers, a map of a library, and a plastic cup. They're not stories, and they're not mine. They're just things. I don't know what to do. But who needs a story anyway, right? Who cares about newspapers, maps, and plastic cups? I think you do. Not really. I can just chuck them on my well, way listen. home. What you hold in your hands are things. But you're also holding a story. But they're just random things I got from other they're places. They're yours now. You can make them yours. They'll still make a pretty boring story. <laughs> they will if you keep thinking in black and white. What do you mean? Take that with you. You'll need it. Tie it all together. Was that... it? Now what makes you think you don't have a good story?